you guys, Strike here, and welcome back to Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Now, it's been a while since I played, and we're actually streaming this one, so if I'm sort of a little bit off focus, that'd be why I'm probably looking at my chat or something. But right now, we have no viewers. That's always great, but at least we got Rosie O'Donnell by our side. So let's get the hell out of here. Oh, there's an actual cutscene. Well, that was the worst thing I've ever seen. What have we actually got around here? I think we went with, like, the rogue-type guy with the daggers and bow. Yeah, we did. Oh, great. I can phase through crates. That's always a good sign. People who bear an icon above their head possess special information. Those bearing green icons have new quests to offer. Well, there is literally nothing here, so thanks for that game. Am I actually, like, in a village? What the hell have we got around here? There's gotta be something, right? Hello? Friends? Is Rosie O'Donnell lonely? Like, I get it that you don't really want to talk to something as disgusting as me, but... <laughs> Come on, guys. I just, like, saved the entire village from a dragon attack. Surely you can, like, I don't know, get on your knees. Give me uh, at least seven sexual favors. Come on, I'm pretty sure I've earned that. I actually have a house? Whoa! Rosie O'Donnell's moving up in the world. Can I actually do anything here? No? Okay. Just gonna destroy my own possessions, because that sounds like a great idea. I can cook! This is- this gets better and better. And by cook, I mean put carrots in a box and hope for the best. Can I break this open? I want to see what actual moves we have here. We have Scarlet Kisses. That's exactly what you want more from my kind of character. There you go. All right, is there anything in here? We have Large Nuts. Finally, people are recognizing the power of my nuts. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay, well, who the hell are you? You guys okay? You just gonna, you know, touch up that guy's foot? I see how it is. How are you doing there, buddy? I'm your cousin? Well, we actually have a family. I mean, you can clearly see the family resemblance here. Jesus, look at your arm. You look like you've been jacking it for three years straight. So you want me to go find him? No, okay, we're just not really gonna care. What about you? Oh my god, you are terrifying. Uh, yeah, I, I am me. Oh, I don't think these guys actually do anything. I haven't got marks above their heads or anything, so we should probably just get out of here. What if we actually got around the village? We have a fisherman's house. This is exactly what I need. Okay, is there anyone actually decent in here? I just don't want to sort of work out what I'm doing and then leave. Oh god, okay, you're naked. How are you doing, buddy? You have an awful voice. I'm just gonna get the hell out of here. Okay, so who would have quests for a little guy like me? Oh, oh okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna get stuck on the freaking wall. What have we got around it? It's literally just ruins. This place got screwed up. Should I just leave? I don't really think I can help out a place like- Oh, okay, you have interesting words. Hello, my friend. God, you don't look that much better than me. That's sort of worrying. Un only you'd known what? Uh, no. No, I can't. Okay, well, she wants us to go find her weed. I mean, I get that it just looks like we got back from molesting an entire orphanage, but I don't think a three-foot-tall transvestite makes a good drug dealer. Okay, let's go. So, where the hell do we actually want to go? So now we've got a job to go find ourselves some weed, which I have no problems with. I mean, we are obviously the most intimidating drug dealer ever. No one's ever going to want to mess with that face. I mean... Well, you know, they'd want to mess with it in certain ways. They wouldn't really want to punch it. They'd more want to, like, face fuck it. Right, so what have we got here? Can I take out a bird? I'm a horrible person, so probably- This is not- Where is my bow? How do I switch to my bow? There we go. Okay. That's a man. Probably don't want to shoot at that guy. He's probably also our cousin. I'm pretty sure our mother got around. Wait, that's not our cousins. Well, I'm gonna drown. I don't really want to be here. So where the hell am I going? I need to find more quests. I don't really know what I'm doing. Like, they sort of just dropped us into the world without really telling us anything of what we're supposed supposed to do. So, I don't know. I guess we're just gonna leave this village. No one else that seems to really want our help. Purchase equipment and useful items from shops or wandering merchants you encounter on your travels. We should probably do that. I mean, we're fairly naked right now. I mean, people might take advantage of us. Hello, who the hell are you? You can restore health and stamina and advance the passage of time at any inn or resting spot. Okay. As you picking flowers for her. Pray, just be cautious, cousin. Why am I- oh, Seriously, why are we everyone's cousin? This isn't normal! Night. If you must leave the village, go prepared. I do not fancy the thought of you going off on your own, but I trust in your judgement. If you come by the inn, you can always rest until the hour you wish to set out. In any case, take care. What can I do you for? Okay... That's... Strange. I guess we just have a ton of uncle brothers going around here. Well, I guess, like, if the entire village is related, 
There's no wonder we look like this, I guess. Let's get out of here. I don't think we really need the inn at the moment. What's this? Notice boards, huh? Oh, so I can get, like, quests here, like The Witcher 3. Reclaim the roads. All manner, blah, 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 blah. I'm gonna accept everything. I'll read through it later. I mean, all these quests are probably gonna murder me, but meh. Doesn't really matter. I should really get some music going, shouldn't I? Oh, I can't really be bothered to do that now. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay. So, just straight up leave the village? I don't really know what we're doing here. Another traveller come to sample the beauty of Rosie O'Donnell? Oh my god, you are a handsome gentleman. Please, get straight inside of me. Oh, okay. That's normal. <laughs> you want some of this? Who the hell are you then? Oh, oh god, teleporting old man! He's of the Pawn Legion. And you're a paedophile! That's literally just what you did, you teleported inside of my rectum. I like to keep that safe, you know. I need that for any beautiful ginger men who decide to come and show me their exploding hands. Quite. Wink, wink. They look the part, sure enough, but they lack the wind. The spark would drive us. They have no okay. capacity to feel nor act alone, so they live as cell swords. Myrmidons, they're called. So you're saying they're my sex slaves? So, we're gonna be- uh, by the way, your arm is sort of inside of your stomach right now, buddy. But, so I guess we're raising an army of sex slaves to go take back our heart from the dragon. I guess that makes sense. I mean, who else would you want in your team? Okay. Hello? Is that your voice? That is your voice. Can I talk to you? No, you're just gonna follow me around. Fantastic. Hello, my friend. <laughs> my literally perfect crotch height. Now I see why you came to me. Okay, so is there nothing good here? Just more large nuts. God damn it, I've got enough large nuts. Two is all you need. Hello? No, can I really not get anything from anyone around here? You know what? I'm just gonna quickly go- I, I know I've sort of rushed through this entire village, so what I'm probably gonna do is I'm just gonna sort of run around. I'm gonna see if I can find any quests, and I'll be right back. So what have we got in here? Uh, okay. <laughs> Did anyone else just hear my attack sound? Hang on. Yeah! <laughs> that is glorious. Okay, well, we're gonna see where the hell we can go then. Sunbright? What the hell is Sunbright? Oh, is that the weed I meant to go find? Okay. Let's see what quest we actually have right now. I don't think I can find anything else around the area. So we have Upon a Pawn. Lead the pawn to the encampment. I guess that's the main quest right now. We've got Floral Delivery. That's the weed quest. Or we can go shoot up some things outside the village. I don't really know what we want to do. I guess we might as well go and do the main quest. Because I'm pretty... My throat is dying. I'm pretty sure we'll be, like, finding the weed along the way anyway, because it said, like, outside the village. But honestly, I have no idea. So I think we're just gonna do a couple of the main quests, and then we'll sort of grab all the quests along the way, and slowly come back and murder the shit out of everything. So what is this? Okay, just more stuff I can murder. Fantastic. I don't really want to just scavenge everything ever, because I'm pretty sure- I mean, there's only so many large nuts one man can handle, okay? Alright, so what- uh, what the fuck? There's more ruins. Is that the same guy? You all- you all look the same. I guess this is like a complete incest village, but hey, I have no problem with that. What else have we actually got around here? There is literally nothing. Fisherman's house. How many fishermen do we need? Fine, let's get out of here. Eh. Oh, okay, I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. Okay, we have perfect surfing skills. Oh! Okay, now you guys actually give a shit? Who are you? Yes, I am. Thank you. You often see those flowers growing at the roots of bigger trees. Not that I'm fain to brave the roads these days. Why are you so twitchy? <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get touched. Just see you're not injured yourself, good fisher. What does that mean? Good fisher? No, no, shut up, Rorik. No one cares about you. Who the hell are you? Oh, you're the old man. We don't really need you again. I don't want to get touched inappropriately. Or maybe I do. Let's just get the hell out of it. Oh, the freaking phasing through walls. Come on. This is how game should be. Who are you? 
You do not look impressed. I'm just gonna get the hell out of here and hope for the best. So I guess what we're gonna do first, let me just set that as my main quest. We're gonna go and find the po I already did. We're gonna go find the pawn encampment, because I feel like that's the only useful thing right now. Because I have no idea what I'm doing, so I'm just gonna go out here, murder a ton of rabbits, murder a ton of goblins, and hope for the best. I wanna see- I kinda wanna see what we're like in battle, because I feel like we're gonna fuck this up severely. Oh, I'm still naked. The game has an autosave function. Period- yeah, I know, I don't really need to say about that. You okay there, Rook? Don't really know what's going on. Oh yeah, your name's Rook! Make it Rook! Hey! Why has every game got a guy called Rook? Why is Rook called Rook? I don't understand. This is all way too much for me. I can't handle this much Rook at once. Okay, well we've got a freaking rabbit here. Why do I need to murder the rabbits? What did the rabbits do wrong? I mean, they're really easy to kill and their AI is completely broken, but oh well. Rook, Rook, come on. I needed, I needed those mushrooms. Okay, fine. So I guess we're just gonna go look for the weed on the way here. I don't really know what I'm doing, though. I, mean, I guess we're just gonna sort of run around and hope for the best, and they sort of just drop you straight into the game without telling you what to do. So, yeah, I have no idea. Bro, are you actually gonna show me the way? I mean, you're the one who knows where you're going. <laughs> that is literally the worst animation for anything I have ever seen. Uh, okay, so what does my right attack do? Is that bow? I'm gonna guess that's bow. That is definitely bow. I think we're gonna stick to the daggers right now, because our bow is literally a piece of shit. Uh-oh! Okay, so that guy can actually die. We do not really want this guy to die. I'm gonna try and save as many people along the road. Now, I know at the end of last episode, I did say we might actually try being a dick, considering... I don't know, our character is ugly enough to be a dick that no one will care. I mean, everyone already hates us, right? If you're ugly, you might as well be a massive douche, because... You know, everyone's already gonna- ugh, Everyone's already gonna know you're a massive idiot. No one likes you anyway. Okay, really? Are you serious? That guy is still just here? Can you at least try fighting back? Look at you, you look like a strapping gentleman. I have no idea what that means. Rook, man! You are like ten times better than me already! Look at that guy. When foes seem too much to handle, try gaining level or obtaining better equipment. Okay, uh, you look really condescending. Did Rosie O'Donnell touch you as a child? That was far too close. Your lips aren't moving. I like that in a man. I'm called Reynard, a traveling salesman, though those damnable beasts ruined my wares. I'll ruin your wares. But thanks to you, it was only wares I lost. I'll consider it a bargain. You have my thanks. Okay. A leather cape! Whoa! We actually have clothes? This is the opposite of what I want. You may see pedals... Pe ple peddlers hawking their wares as you make way around the Grand Seas. What the hell are the Grand Seas? Is that just like the whole world or is it just the one part we're in? Okay, well where the hell are my clothes? Not really sure I want to stick a carrot inside of my anus. That'll be for after the video. Alright, so what have we got here? Set of fishermen's tatters. Are they better than what I'm wearing right now? I only got a pleb shirt. I guess we might as well wear this. Move to equipment. What? I have no idea what I'm doing, but I'm just gonna equip that. Do we- uh, we look even shittier? So I either can have a bare chest, which I have no problem with, or we can actually be a respectable gentleman. Why have I got such a short skirt? <laughs> God damn it. Okay, we don't want to go with this. We're just gonna go into the inventory, and I'm gonna shove on these. This is not what I wanted. Where is my cape? There's my cape. Okay, there we go. Confirm. Move to equipment. Equip. There we go. Right, do we actually look maybe even a slight bit cooler? Wow, we actually don't look bad. What am I wearing? God damn it, I'll be right back. Pleb shirt. Okay, so I guess I just can't be bare chested. Damn it, my life is ruined. Okay, well at least we actually, I don't know. I don't really know how the cape helps us. It didn't really have like any armor there or anything. But hey, we're already Jesus. Like we can take on three goblins without any issues. What is that? Really? Just freaking more goblins? I think I had a quest to kill goblins, so we might as well just tear their anus out every time we see them. What are you doing? You're slapping your own genitals with your club. This is the opposite of what I wanted. Only I'm allowed to slap my genitals on your club. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Okay, you actually seem a lot cooler than the last one. God damn it, am I blowing myself already? Calm down. Save that to after the video. Okay, he's already dead. We might as well take this. Wormwood sap and or semen. Fantastic. Let's just get to the encampment. I'm pretty sure, like, early on in the game, the only enemies we're ever gonna get is goblins. So, we might as well just keep going to the camp and hope we level up along the way. Is there no weed? I was expecting way more weed than this, but okay. I'm actually amazed that we're not that shit, even though we have no armor. Rosie O'Donnell, come on. Keep going. We're so close. I can run for, like, three inches, and then I fall over and just self-fellatio myself. Is there anything over here? Ooh. 
I should probably make friends with these guys, but I could also nuke everything they've ever owned, right? Wait, what? I have triple ar arrows? That's actually pretty cool. We've got some pretty cool bow attacks. Like, if I can combine that, like, with Rook's flame abilities, I don't know. That's probably going to go pretty well. Silencer arrow? I guess we can become, like, an assassin type thing with my loadout. Quest successful. Pawns will collect uh, and use items of their own volition. Okay, so I don't actually need to be his mother. I mean, Rosie O'Donnell, come on, she'd make a great parent. Listen to- Oh, God, okay, Rook. When it said you use items on your own volition, I didn't think you'd immediately commit suicide. But fine, whatever you're into, buddy. I mean, hey, I'm pretty sure someone out there's got a suicide fetish. Now, what the hell have we got in here? What is it, father? Okay, he doesn't actually care. I don't know what the hell that was, but it did absolutely nothing. Who the hell are you? Can I talk to you guys? Hello. I fear we cannot yet join a covenant. This lip syncing actually wants me to go and remove my own genitals with a rusty butter knife. Okay, so what have we got over here? We got Rook and more cutscenes. Okay, if you've forgotten where you are in the story, select Chronicle from the pause menu to review a history of your journey thus far. Okay, who the hell are you? You look important. I have no idea what that means. Can I steal all of your weapons already? No, I can't. Command headquarters. Well, you seem like a fashionable gentleman. Okay. Your mouth literally doesn't open. You look like you've had 73 strokes in the space of five minutes. New skills? I'd like to learn some more skills, actually. We've sort of just got, like, really basic dagger attacks. We have no money. Fantastic. Okay, well, I'll be back for you later, buddy. Right, what have we got here? I don't care. Discipline can be used, blah, 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 blah. I don't really care. What is this, then? This is, like, the thing we saw in the first episode, and it... Wait, when was that? I'm pretty sure this is what Rook climbed out of. No. No, no, I can't continue. There we go. I have no idea what that means, but if it means I get more sex slaves, I'm happy to do it. If you are an arisen in truth, this humble task will prove no obstacle. The arisen must possess the valor to stand against all threats and the power to quell them. A tireless spirit of self improvement grants the strength to lead the legion. Craig, show you now. Self improvement? So, so, so masturbating? I'm not sure I really want to do this in public, but sure. Okay, well, we gotta go find the masturbation key, so I'm just gonna go around here and see what I can find first. Heart spud sauce. I have no idea what that means, but thank you. You look like a pretty cool guy. Do you have anything for me? I can make your times a lot harder. Okay, well, we can actually go and see what we can do out here. Is I have no idea what I'm doing. i just sort of running around. Can I go and buy some actual equipment? Because, I don't know, I feel like my genitals are going to get cold. I don't really want to see any shrinkage going on down there with Rosie O'Donnell. Oh, oh, pfft. Why are there so many cutscenes? Wait, are you talking about my dick again? You guys okay out there? I'm not that terrifying. I just want to put it, actually, I probably am. Yeah, I know, Rook. That's probably why they're running to their deaths. What is actually going on over here? No one actually cared. They started screeching and then never did anything about it. Okay, I see how it is. What am I actually meant to do? Quest. Okay. Uh, he should be so lucky. Slay five rabbits. Definitely. That's what I'm meant to do. We're going to go for that. Call of the Arisen. How do I set as my priority? There we go. Check the area around the encampment until you find a threat that must be quelled. So it wants me to leave? Okay, I guess I'll leave. Wait, that didn't make sense. It wanted me to stay there. Ah, I don't really care. We'll go see what's outside anyway. We sort of done, like, the slightest- Oh, okay. What the fuck is that? And why is it already bending over for me? Why do I have the effect on everything that looks like that? That's depressing. Oh well. Even Rosie O'Donnell has to find love sometimes. I mean, honestly, there's a lot he can do with those horns. Let's jump straight on its kneecaps. That seems like a perfectly good way to start. Oh, okay. I've already been thrown in the fire. Well, I'll see you guys after my cremation. 
Look at my health already. Yeah, Rook, I'd appreciate uh, not dying. Maybe I can cling to its anus. Come on, man. Get the hell over here. There you go. What the fuck? I can't do anything. Okay. Ow. I am dead. As you take damage, the amount of health you can recover through magic in the field also decreases. Indicated by a white bar. Rest at the end, blah, 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 blah. I guess I need more armor. <laughs> Retry. Restart the point when you last started the game. No, I didn't save the game for a while. So we're just going to go to a checkpoint. Last auto save it. Oh, in or rift? Oh, shit. Ah. Uh, Aha. <laughs> checkpoint. Let's try checkpoint. I don't really know when that was. So if it puts me right back at the start, that's going to be a problem. Training grounds. Maybe I can, like, level up a bit here. Ooh, okay. More quests. So we're going to grab all these first. Phantasms. Okay, so ghostly orgasms. I can definitely work on that. Basic training. What am I meant to do for basic training? Because I should probably do that before I t try and take on my lover, I guess. What have we actually got around here? Uh, basic training, basic training, basic training. Slate eight spiders. I thought I was actually getting training. Fine, okay. So that's my main quest, so I shouldn't do that. Someone is calling me on my phone. Who the hell is that? Ah! Oh god, don't answer. Okay, I'm just gonna leave that for later. Can I go into, like, the training grounds? I can't go into the training grounds. So I guess we've gotta take on this thing while we are the most unprepared anyone has ever been. This is gonna be fun. Okay, fine. Uh, I guess I can just let, like, my pawn do it. I think last time I did this, like, on um, the original Dragon's Dogma, I think I sort of did, like, most of the side quests and leveled up a ton before I even attempted doing, like, half of the main quests. So this is gonna be fun. Okay, so, can I skip this? I can't skip this. Let's do this. No, oh, I'm just gonna wait behind here. Uh, have fun, guys. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm too short to actually get hit from here. Are there any other enemies? I can probably take out a few goblins. Yeah, let's take out some goblins. Let's actually try and be like, I don't know, a little bit useful. Can I grab enemies? If I can grab like the little enemies. Oh my god, goodbye. <laughs> that was amazing. Oh, you didn't fall, you douche. Okay, well, let's just pick up his semen. What have we got around here? Just more goblin. Really? I have to be the one to take on the only guy who's actually tough? That's an issue, and I'm about to die. I need to drink. How do I drink? I need, like, a carrot. Carrots are obviously the- Wait, do I eat some of my large nuts? I don't feel comfortable eating my own nuts, especially not on camera. Okay, fine. Well, that healed us up a little bit. Looks like I'm gonna survive, I don't know, another three seconds at most? Yeah, that's good. Okay, let's just stab the shit out of these guys and hope the knights actually know how to deal with that guy. Oh no, okay, we're gonna die. Time to break out the large nuts. Come on, testicles, don't fail me now. That healed like nothing. Fantastic. Right, so what actually heals health? That heals health. Carrots. Okay, I'm pretty sure we're good for like another three minutes. Uh, guys, can you actually damage that guy in the slightest? I have no idea. I'm just gonna jump on his leg. I hate my life. I hate my life so much. Right, so what can I actually eat? There has to be something that will get me through this. Uh, curatives, curatives, curatives. Milky water, health and stamina. I'll do that. Okay, that'll be enough to survive, like, one more hit, I guess. Have fun, guys. I'm gonna hide in the bushes. Okay. Oh, wow. This is actually gonna take a long time. Like, last time, this was so much easier, and I don't know why. Let's just kick the hell out of that guy. There you go. Please let me grip your anus. Come on. Rosie O'Donnell has never had someone fight him for that before. There you go. So if we're climbing on top of him, this is actually the easiest thing ever. Okay, fine. I'm in his armpit. I do not want to get crushed under there. Okay, let's just uh, climb all the way up. Maybe if we hit him in the head, we're actually going to get something done. Let's do this. There you go. That's fucking attractive. Where the hell did that th <laughs> Come back! I need you in my life! Okay, fine. Where the hell did that guy go? That guy looked like he had, uh, he had something to say to me. Where the hell did that corpse go? I should probably go and grab that. Uh, oh well. Like, I don't really know- Is it already been set on fire? Why do I have such small nuts? Damn! Okay, well I guess we need a new lover. Let's go the hell back in the encampment. Do these guys actually have anything to say? Like, I kind of just saved your life. You guys suck. Okay, fine. Let's get the hell back in here. We've done as asked. 
Let us go and give word of it. You are aggressive. I like that in a man. Okay, hello. Were you the guy who looked really suspicious and looks like he's about to go and touch children? You were probably the guy who looks like he's about to go touch children. I mean, I'm pretty sure everyone in this entire game is probably a child molester. Let's see what we can do in here. Okay. Ekbot. I didn't read that at all. <laughs> Fantastic. Let's go see what we can do here then. With... The okay. I forgot this game actually has voice acting. You are the Okay, so we get some more pawns here. That's in Oh, I actually get to make a pawn. Well, uh, okay, this is going to be interesting. Do I make something as sheerly messed up as me? Or do I make something I'm actually proud of? Well, Rosie O'Donnell is a man in my playthrough, so maybe we should actually get a female. Yeah, let's actually go with a female. But uh, what do we want to do here? Okay, name. Um... This isn't what I wanted. Fine, we'll just give you this first. What do we want to call you? What's an even worse name than Fanny? Uh, Max M. Bison. Sure. I have no idea why that's a name, but M. Bison. Name. Uh, what do we want to call you? There's got to be something good. Uh, I, I know. It won't let me type. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, well, that's that done. Now we actually need to get into the actual building of it. What? I can't call you that? Okay, I can call you that. That's always a good sign. Now, we are, what are we? We're a rogue, so we probably need something a little bit tougher. I have no idea. Should we get like a knight or should we get whatever the fuck that is? Maybe we should get a mage. No, Rook's already a mage, so I think we're gonna go with a knight. So let, uh, what's a better looking knight? That's probably a good looking knight. Uh, right, what can we do here? Test voice. <laughs> Perfect, we'll go with that one. Uh, confirming more detailed error edits. I actually want to be decently... Okay, what's like the least feminine haircut possible? Fuck it, we'll go with the giant. Let's do this. Stature... We need them to be fairly nimble. Like, if they're a knight, actually, maybe they should be... I guess, like, being heavy makes them tougher. I have no idea. I kind of want, like, a nimble knight, though. Because if they're really slow and we're tiny and fast, then again, we're fat. I have no idea how fast Rosie O'Donnell is. We're just going to leave it in the middle. And skin color, we should probably go with something disgusting. Okay. These are all the same color. What? Okay, fine. We'll go with pink. Let's do this. Confirm. How do I get out of here? Uh, we're going to go all the way over there. I can't go all the way over there. I can't do anything. What the fuck? Oh, I can do more. Torso. Oh, no. I don't really want to go, like, all the way into this. Scars. You need to be the most fucked up individual in the land. We're going to go with that. Uh, wrinkles. All the wrinkles possible. There you go. You are a handsome woman, I guess. Right. What's some good makeup for someone like you? You pr I mean... I don't- I think you can go fully without. You have that all-natural kind of look, you know? You- you can- you can really pull it off, but then again... I wouldn't mind fucking you up even more. So we're gonna go with that. Color adjustment. Where's, like, a really disgusting green? Oh! You have contacts! Okay, what- oh, that's eye color, that'd be why. Makeup color... Uh, why can't I change the color? The lipstick doesn't actually change. Fine, just that then. And we're gonna get out of here. That is my pawn complete. Let's get the fuck out of here. Continue. What? You will be asked a few questions. When faced with danger, which trait would you most value in a follower? Charisma to lead others, careful preparation. I guess I might actually try answering these seriously, considering we've already destroyed everything else. Careful preparation, yeah. Uh, while in battle, which strategy would you prefer your follower to employ? Kill all enemies, that's my job. Rescue comrades in danger. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Like, if they're a knight, think if they're a knight, we're either gonna want- They don't have to be smart. So, either of the first three. We could get them to kill all people, which is something I want to do. So, I guess we're gonna get them to be, like, a guardian-type character? I don't really know. What does that really put up? That puts up Scather. Ah, strike at the strongest foes. Screw it. Uh, your follower rescues your party and turns the tide of the entire battle. What would you have them say? This way, master! Leave them to me. Oh, master, strike the final blow quickly after them. Um, 
Yeah, we'll let them get- let, we'll, we'll let me get the final blow. As a ruler, which gift would please you most? Oh, <laughs> uh, Bend over. Okay, uh, a brave and just hero to succeed you. No, I do not want that succeeding me. Look at that. I mean, it's glorious and all, but I don't really think people would respect it as king. Rosie O'Donnell, on the other hand, is the epitome of manly. Right, a majestic white steed. Are you saying we're going to be riding it? Not really sure I want to be doing that. The perfect spouse. Definitely! Yeah, perfect. Uh, what does this look like? We're gonna... Oh, vocation. Fighter. Yes, we actually do want a knight for once. I've never actually been a knight in this, in like the original Dragon's Dogma, so this is gonna be interesting. I've I, I never actually used them. Don't look at me like that! Oh my god! Don't get on your knees! I know what's coming! To you, Risen. From this day, the Legion's men call pawns live and die by your command. That's pretty kinky. Having been recognized as a Risen, you have been granted a loyal pawn to be your constant companion in your journey. In addition to this main pawn, you may hire up to two other pawns. Okay, so we can get another one other than Rook, which means we probably... I don't know, do we want another mage? I could do with healers, because honestly, we're pretty shit right now in our current state. We just need some, like, armor and some better weapons, and then we'll be good. But for now, I might want to go and get another healer. So let's just jump in here and see who else we can get. What is that face in the background constantly looking at me in the anus? I need my anus perf in perfect shape for Cock Hoover over there. Uh, Helena, no? Okay, what do we have here? You're a fighter, you're a ranger, you're a mage. You actually look really freaking terrifying, so we're gonna take you. Okay, I will enlist you. Your voice does not fit you. Oh my god. Okay, you're like the world's poshest rich boy, and you look like that. That's probably racist somewhere, but oh well. Insult the history. How do I get out of here? Rook. Why is Rook here? We already have Rook, so let's just get the hell out of here. Exit the rift. Wait, did Rook leave? Was he just like the starter pawn? I have no idea. We're gonna keep Rook for now, though, if he's still here. Hmm. Water. We still have Rook, okay. Ah, a master and his born, is uh, I think you're, uh, that's not how you spell sex slave. You'll be quite the force. Come the day you learn to fight as well. Oh, trust me. We've been, we've, <laughs> yes. Mind you, that is a skill better honed in Oh, so now we actually get some fighting practice. That's gonna be good for me. Should you wish. Wait, so it's a choice, or are we actually just gonna get thrown in there? It's that fucker again. Who the fuck are you? Is that where we are? Or did he just leave where we are? Is he just... Maybe he's Rosie O'Donnell's secret admirer. We don't know. A man of the enlistment corps. So we... Yeah, sure. We'll begin training. I mean, honestly, if it gives me more power, I should probably have listened to that. Sure, I'm ready. If it gives us more power, and we're as awful as we are now, it's definitely be gonna be something useful. So what do we actually have to do? Crates. Full of scrotums. Fantastic. So we've got to put the scrotum in the glowing hole of death. That sounds like, sir, uh, to be honest, I mean, we've already got our German torture porn going on here. We might as well step it up a notch. What is this? How do I pick you up? F. Okay, so it's like we're gripping to another ogre's testicles. We just got to do it like this. Come on, scrotums. Just come, come this way. I mean... Rosie O'Donnell, you just got away with scrotums, you know? Your name is Lelou. Lelou. Nothing about you fits your face. It's really scary. Okay, so we're just gonna put that down there. Are we done? That's all the scrotums he could ever wish for. Fantastic. Well done. Meet each challenge with that vigor, and you'll make for a fine warrior of war. Whenever scrotums are involved, just gotta be vigorous, you know? Next is combat training. You'll face my scarecrow army here. Destroy them before my count ends. Wait, are you actually throwing murder death at us? That's not good. But you must choose your companions wisely. 
A company all doing the same thing is less effective than using a varied approach. Choose well. We'll begin as soon as you're prepared. Let's do it. We might as well complete all the training possible while we're like as awful as we are now, then come back and it will have like no effect on us. So I'm just gonna tear the hell out of these goddamn scarecrows. Is that it? Is that all you could offer me? Are you that awful? Okay, fine. We're just gonna climb up here. Wow. Okay, well, my mages are actually Jesus. Lelou has ice attacks. So we've got Rook, who's like a fiery Hitler. And then we've got Lelou, who's just gonna fuck up everything with this giant bear penis. And then we've just got Rook, who does absolutely nothing useful, just like the real Rook. Well done. Meet each challenge with that vigor, and you'll make for a fine. Yeah, you say that every time. Finally, you'll be destroying more scarecrows, but don't expect a repeat of the last. There are two sorts of scarecrow, each with its own weakness. One falls only to steel and brute force, the other only to magic. If you're not mindful of how you attack them, you'll fail. Strike fast and strike hard. Vary your party and your tactics until you find success. Use your head. We'll begin as soon as you're prepared. Okay, so we gotta give the Scarecrow's head, and then we should be good. And I, I have no problem with that, so which color are the ones that, like, need to be spanked? I guess it's the red ones. So I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna take out all these. You guys got Cooper. I forgot I named him. He just runs over and fucks everything up. Good job, Cock Hoover. I'm proud of you. Okay, can we use our special attack on that? Our first hit from the special attack completely just nukes it. That is amazing. Okay. I like the Scarlet Kisses, but then again, pretty sure everyone could not resist a Scarlet Kiss from Rosie O'Donnell. What have we got over here? There is nothing good. Okay, they're up there. Rook, calm down, my friend. Oh, Rook just fucked that guy up. God damn. That's the fastest I've ever seen it done. That's and not that's usually a good thing when it comes to giving head. Well done. You've completed your training. See now the difference well selected partners can make. Yes, no doubt. No doubt. Okay. You'll learn the rest from actual combat. If you have trouble, examine your part. Oh, I'll be doing a lot of examining of Cock Hoover. If your strategies seem toothless, I don't know what that means, against your foes, try changing your party makeup. Enabled skills and equipment. Okay, so you're saying we just throw on a new face and we just dazzle them with our sheer beauty. That'll be no problem for me. Okay, so Cock Hoover leveled up. That's always a good sign. Now we can Hoover even bigger cocks. So what have we got here? Let's go to our quest. What do we actually have to do? Do we have a main quest right now? Set against the dead, basic training. Cyclopses. I'm just gonna quickly look through. I'll be right back. We don't have a main quest. So I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go gather some weed, but I don't really know. What else can we do? Encampment. I might go take a look around the encampment, because honestly, we're rushing through everything. I've got, like, nothing we actually need. Is there anything going on up here? Like, we didn't even explore the upper level. Oh, hello, my friend. Uh, I'll talk to you later. I just want to explore the rest of this place first. Enlistment corpse base. Okay, well, we already knew that. There is nothing good around here. What the hell? Oh, at least we got a quest. We'll go see what the hell you want. Hang on a sec. I want to see if I can just pick up anyone I want. I can! Hell freaking yes! Let's go, Rosie O'Donnell! Oh god, he's fighting back. He's a feisty one. We're just gonna throw him at the wall. We didn't need him anyway. What do I find here? Grand Cease Herb. Okay. Uh, fine. What the hell do you do? I am Mercedes. I lead the men of the enlistment corps. Hello, you French fuck. I've heard talk of the Arisen. They say you hold dominion over the pawns. I've ordered pawns to take up swords and fight myself. They are a clumsy lot. I cannot call them into this world as you do, though. You'll make traveling companions of them. What manner of magic lets you command them so? A good, firm hand and discipline. Well, it matters not. The dragon is come. I'll welcome any help, be it pawn, a reason, farmer or fishwife. Make use of the encampment as you please. Are you in need of rest? Does that mean what I think it means? Because yes, I'm in need of rest. Repose is the better part of readiness. I have no idea what that means, but uh, I'll, I'll see you in a sec. Oh god, oh my god, that is terrifying! Please, just- uh, ah, I need soap in my eyes!
Well, the two-headed crotch strikes again, and I'm still naked. This is not what I wanted. I'm going to need some actual weapons soon. Fine, let's just cling to its face, and I'm going to start cutting off its head, because this is probably the best way of going about dealing with a two-headed crotch. Really? You're already down? Can I just climb up? Oh, wow. This is prob- Ah! Okay! This penis has a mind of its own, man. I've never seen a dick that flails this much, and I've seen a lot of dicks. Okay, fine. Let me see if I can actually get in its mouth. That seems like a good idea. I can't get any closer. Fine. Where am I finding rocks? Who is making that dick swallow rocks? Okay, fine. Oh, wow. I thought the character. I thought Rosie O'Donnell was the kinkiest in the land, but we've got a rival. Okay, fine. We should probably get out of here. Cock Hoover, if you could, I don't know, actually do something useful, I'd appreciate it. What are you doing? You are not. Do Ow! Yeah, if someone could, uh. Maybe help in any way possible, I would appreciate it. Who are we clinging to? Okay. Oh, time to climb up another penis. These guys take no damage. This sucks. Can I use my special attacks on them? I can. Okay. I wonder what the heavy attack does while we're up here. I should probably try that instead of just using, like, Scarlet Kisses and all that. Oh, wow. So, literally, Rosie O'Donnell right now, even kissing the peen, is doing literally, like, no damage. I don't know what I've got to do here. I might just go back here and eat some more testicles. What have we got? That's not how I go in my inventory. What have we got here? Do I actually need to eat? Scrag of Beast. I read that as breast. Fine, we'll eat that. Oh, that's stamina. Okay. Well, I have no idea how to heal myself, so I guess we're just gonna dive straight back in. Ah, oh, can I hit him from there? At least Cock Hoover actually does claim with a lot of damage. Am I meant to kill this entire thing? I feel like I've skipped half the game. How am I this shit still? I do no damage to anyone. I guess I've got to find its weak spot or something. Maybe I should read, like, the dialogue if we can cleave off all of its heads. Yeah, I'm trying. But they're sort of incredibly freaking powerful. Fine, let's use Scarlet Kisses again. How much damage do I actually do? Literally, I can't get a single hit because it's starting goddamn flailing. Okay, fine. We're just going to get down here. Oh, wow. How do we recharge our stamina? I don't want to eat all of the breasts. Come on, we've got to save some breasts for other people. Can the camp this size truly keep monsters at bay? Maybe I can, like, drop a building on its face or something? I have no idea. I should also stop sprinting. It's using up, like, all of my stamina. Okay, I'm gonna go blow myself in a corner. Hang on. Oh, did something happen? God damn it! Okay, Rosie O'Donnell, please stop with the flagellation. Oh, okay. Well, I guess when they're inside of the penis tip, I guess you're meant to, like, get a special attack off or something? That seems like a pretty good up. Really? Fine. We're gonna climb up this ladder, actually, and I'm gonna see if I can, like, do a diving attack. That seems like a pretty good idea, right? Come on, up we go. There you go, Rosie O'Donnell. Oh, this guy is dying. Oh, okay, well, I can't grab that guy. We're just gonna finger his anus a little bit first. I can't grab it! No, I'm gonna die from full damage! God damn it. I'll be right back. Oh! Oh, it's the merchant! Maybe we can actually buy some armor from this guy or something. I don't really think we need to do that well. We do need to do a lot more damage, actually. How much money do we have? We have 5.5k. Everything he has is actually fairly cheap. Okay, so 1110, 111. I'm pretty sure this is better. So if we get leather belts, maybe. Or a chest guard. What's better? Leather chest guard, huh? Is that better than all of it? I get, like, a leather chest guard and other stuff. Okay, fine. For now, we'll get leather belts. We'll see if we can sell some stuff to- No, I don't want your bandages. What do bandages do? No, screw you. All right, so chest guard- No, belts. There you go. We'll get one of those. Uh, confirm. And we'll see if they have some more weapons, I guess. That seems like a good idea. Torso, we're just gonna go and throw on those belts. There's gotta be something around here. All right, uh, is this me? This is- This is my inventory. Why is he selling testicles? Come on, are you a prostitute too? Is this really not bringing in enough money? I just gave you 3,000 gold. Maybe it's, uh, gonna have a happy ending. Where the hell are my weapons? There you go. Okay. Trusty sword. This isn't what I want. I need daggers. There you go. Throat cutters. I'm 100 gold off. Can I sell something? How do I sell? Let's get out of here. Oh, God. Okay. Just drop straight into the crotch again. Oh, okay. A crotch is tangled. This is not good. I hate it when my crotch gets tangled. Which crotch am I climbing? God damn. Okay, fine. Let's just stab the hell out of it. Look at the damage we do now. Okay, I like these throat cutters. Can I do the scarlet kisses on the crotch? Yes, I can. Okay, nice. Can I do the kicking attack? I don't really want to do some kicking and dicking, though, to be honest. I mean, no one wants to dick another man's crotch. Actually, well, except, like, the entire homosexual agenda. Let's jump down here. Are you serious? How do I take that much damage? Oh my god! Okay, so let's eat some testicles. Let's, uh, what have we got here? We got any health? Uh, stamina. 
That's health. Okay, so let's eat some, uh, some herbs or whatever the hell that is. And let's get the hell out of here. How do I dodge roll or anything? God damn it. Sorry, see O'Donnell. This is not the time. Thank you, Rook. Why are you carrying a lantern on your anus? Oh my god. I hate my life. So much. Yes! Okay! Something actually happened! Oh god! We cut off a pin! Uh, no! You can't do that to another man's pin, man! That's just, just, just way too much! Also, I'm pretty sure we just got covered in semen. You don't even look upset! Oh! Someone branded his pin? That's not nice! No one likes a fiery pin in the morning. In the evening, sure. But, you know. Your handiwork? For true? Oh, what did the lack of an idol doing here anyway? Ancient tales of the Arisen are well and good, friends. But make a gift of these heads to the Duke. The Duke likes collecting penises? He sounds like my kind of guy. For Arisen, I see better now from whence the legends arose. Good judgment, swift footwork. Impressive, truly. In any case, the Duke will want to know of this attack. I'd hoped to gather a larger force before leaving for the capital, but a Hydra's head and the Orison who claimed it make up the difference amply. I cannot say what the pass may hold. You will need your strength. It will be slow going with a cart. I dare say you'll have no trouble catching up. Okay, so I we'll guess we're actually going to go meet a duke and deliver a pin. How are we carrying an entire penis with us? I mean, come on, we've got enough large nuts. This is going to be way too much. Okay, well, we just got a lot of money. Maybe I can actually buy some decent stuff now. Cock Hoover leveled up again. Cock Hoover leveled up twice. Oh my god, imagine all the cocks we can blow now. Okay, guys. Well, I'm probably going to end this episode off here. This was a fun one. It took a while, and I think we're not really prepared enough to do the main quest right now. So I'm probably going to go back. I'm going to pick up some weed, and we will be back. But for now, hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is Strike signing off. Goodbye, my friends.